the truth of the current media assassination attempts on Bhagavan Nityananda Paramashivam. Over the past 10 years, well over 15,000 hours of slanderous, false, instigating lies have been spread across yellow TV stations in the character assassination of Sri Nityananda Paramashivam. He is the victim of the fake rape charge and the only rape charge filed in India that never even named a victim. A fake rape charge was used to execute so many attacks against Sri Nityananda Paramashivam and his followers and the charge could never even name a single alleged victim. Atrocious. He was the victim of illegal arrests, wrongful imprisonment and heinous tortures at the hands of police and co-conspirators. He was poisoned on numerous occasions and subjected to an illegal medical test where he was injected with an unknown substance that caused him to have a heart attack and be confined to a wheelchair as a result. His various temples were broken into, burned and looted and the male and female monks were beaten, raped and abducted. Only violence has been done to him by the media mafia circus. The result, Bhagavan Nityananda Paramashivam has continued to stand amidst the many defeated cases against him although the corrupt attack is endless. More than six million dollars in legal penalties have been imposed on conspirators and media. One blackmailing conspirator was sentenced to close to five years in a United States prison for raping the child of a temple priest and attempting to blackmail the family and another fined five million dollars for defamation and civil conspiracy. Many media stations have been ordered to issue public apologies. The COO of Sun TV confessed to their role in creating fake news for extortion purposes. Police further exposed the conspiracy by publicly bribing and begging for any random person to come forward and claim they were raped. After 10 years of searching, even a fake lie could not be mustered. Nothing. Sri Nityananda Paramishivam is a world leader recognized by all major Hindu organizations who works tirelessly to provide all the best things freely to the society, yet the baseless, opportune attacks by the corrupt machinery continues. Every major Hindu organization targeted and defamed. It has become a routine. If you feel responsibility is a power, you make your life successful.